Hello, everyone. My name is Phil Gibson, the program manager on the open source upstream team here at Microsoft. And today I want to talk to you about securing your open source adoption. So as we know, Kubernetes has been a game changer for many organizations. And with its rapid adoption, transparency into compliance matters even more. This intersection between cloud native architectures, open source tooling, and day zero operational governance has amplified the need to simplify ways to achieve compliance and controls. So with Azure, we found it makes sense to build our Kubernetes ecosystem projects upstream first in open source. We think open source tooling is the best way to enable highly secure enterprise ready Kubernetes. So today let's take a walk through some of these exciting projects in the security space. Built on top of the open policy agent project as a cross organization collaboration, Gatekeeper provides the ability to evaluate and validate configurations being deployed to a Kubernetes cluster. Users can craft their policies using regular templates to meet their company's operational compliance requirements, such as using only authorized container registries and container images to allow and disallow with ease. Safely store your Kubernetes secrets outside of your cluster with the Secret Store CSI project. Kubernetes secrets made it easy and convenient to store sensitive information outside of your application but this is still within the confines of your cluster. The Secret Store CSI project keeps all the look and feel of the Kubernetes secret intact, but adds additional protection moving your secrets outside the cluster for seamless experience. The Azure Active Directory Pod Managed Identity Project provides you with flexibility to control what access an application or Kubernetes can have. Cluster operators can configure fine-grained controls on authorizing pods to access resources outside the Kubernetes cluster, such as, a, such as access to a database without the need to have authentication logic inside your application. Use this open source project to simplify your cloud native application resources by moving the authorization logic out of the container and onto the Kubernetes cluster. Service meshes simplify securing and routing traffic both inside and outside a Kubernetes cluster moving service mesh configurations out of the applications to make it an operational configuration component. Service, the service mesh interface specification project provides a common integration and configuration point for all service meshes and service mesh tooling that adheres to the SMI specification. And we're working with collaborators across the ecosystem on evolving the spec to meet the community's growing needs. Open Service Mesh simplifies the operational overhead introduced by Service Mesh. OSM makes it effortless to enable the most sought after features and functionality that organizations look for in an SMI compliant Service Mesh. And with MTLS encryption, you can meet your enterprise grade data provenance and integrity guarantees. Protecting data in transit and at rest isn't enough. We also wanna protect data in use. The Open Enclave SDK enables building applications based on the trusted execution environments and has been in production use for well over a year at several companies across both Intel SGX and ARM Trust Zone. Now, even though this project is a low level C, C++ SDK, it provides the foundation to enable higher level programming languages and applications. Such as Mysticos, a project I'm personally really excited about. Based on the Open Enclave SDK, Mystico supports unmodified Linux binaries, such as many Golang programs, and makes it easy to migrate from Docker containers to SGX trusted execution runtime environment. This open source project is in its infancy, but the potential and prospects of the security benefits that will be solved are huge. So watch this space for more support as new syscalls are being added all the time. So thanks for coming along on this whirlwind tour of all these great open source security based projects. Hopefully you saw a project that will offer a solution to your current security needs or inspiration for your next open source contribution. You can read about all of these projects and more at opensource.microsoft.com. Thank you for your time and we'll see you out there on GitHub.